Happy Tuesday, everybody. We're back here at the Premium Outlets to go to the Disney Outlet Store because the last time we were here was like a month ago. The last time you were here, I, uh, I didn't I get to come. I came by myself. So I get to finally like see what's new. Yeah, and... I, uh, I heard they have some stuff that we actually just looked at at Animal Kingdom Ooh. like a few vlogs back. So that's kind of interesting like how quickly it goes to the, uh, to the outlet. Yeah, and I'm interested to see if there's something different from the last time there was a lot of Christmas stuff. So I'm interested to see if like there's another holiday. <laughs> oh, be careful, there's a little <laughs> tiny bump there. Last time we were here, I didn't come in on this side. I came in on the totally opposite side. I didn't know that there was a playground here for kids to play at while they're at the mall. This is like kind of a, a place that I feel like you could spend all day at. Oh, definitely. Big. Here's where the playground was. And the last time I had to walk all the way through everything. And this time we're literally going like right there. It's right next to the food court. I knew where to park. Yeah, nice yeah, work. I got all the, all the secret info. She, you're like a mall connoisseur. I feel like I might be. <laughs> here we are at the character warehouse. And one thing I didn't realize, there's a bar right here. Like you can go get like mixed drinks, cocktails and beers and then serve, go well i think they serve snacks too oh yeah and then go disney shopping oh yeah <laughs> i didn't show this last time but you can actually purchase multi-day walt disney world tickets here not at a discounted rate but you can still buy the tickets here walk right into a huge star wars display and this looks like it's the star wars what the new hope no what's it called rogue episode one. rogue one this looks like it's from rogue one Ooh, i like this guy's outfit yeah he's wearing a cape who is this his name is uh orson krennic General Krennic, I think. Is he a bad guy? I think so. Oh no, I like his outfit though. Oh no. He's tricking you though, because he's wearing all white. Is this Kylo? No. That's... It's a lady. Yeah, that's the, the girl oh, from Rogue One. Oh my One. gosh, I only saw the hair. Sorry, please don't hate me. I don't just... like you can change her hands out if you want to. Well, because one hand holds a gun. Oh, okay. They sell a Star Wars Nerf ATAT or AT AT that is app controlled through Bluetooth, it's like you, it says remote control through Bluetooth, so you use your phone and you can control it and shoot Nerf missiles at your brothers and sisters. Oh, from this? Yeah. For $10, you can get this Walt Disney World Cinderella Castle insulated tote. Like it, it will keep your cold stuff cold. It's like a little cooler. Ooh, I kind of really like this shirt. If I were a lady, I would wear this $15 shirt for Magic Kingdom. Is this the same print for the 45th anniversary? Yeah, I think so, because this is 1971. But it doesn't have the 45th anniversary like thing on it. Right, huh. maybe it's not. But it, but it's like the same. Yeah. Interesting. Whoa, look at this shirt. It's pretty neat. How much do you think? It says 46, but I don't know if it's not on sale maybe? Let me see if there's another one. No, I think this is one of the things that's full price. Dang, how much is this R2-D2 shirt? It is, and check out the cool back on it. Oh yeah, $15. I think that's maybe still not low enough on the price. Is this a Star Wars kimono? It says adult one size. Oh, it is. And it's $20. Oh, that's kind of fun. They look like they're doing like a line dance or something, oh, they're, right? They're uh, space, what are they called? Space people. Stormtroopers. <laughs> no, look at Space Mickey. Space Mini, sorry. Isn't she Tron? I don't know. Is that Tron Mini? For $20, you could have this ambiguous Space Tron Mini. There's a rock and roller coaster sweater. It's, um, like a, it's kind of a nice, if it wasn't a rock and roller coaster sweater, <laughs> it's kind of nice. How much is it? For $35, you could have an Aerosmith Rock This Way sweater from Rock and Roller Coaster. I kind of like this. It's like a, it's a, a rain nice, coat. but it's like a really nice raincoat. Wow, how yeah, much is it? $24.99. Mm, that's not that's too much. bad. Yeah, that's not bad. Still got some Halloween stuff from the cruise line. I think I showed this last time. For $10, you can have a little half turvis. Neverland's finest Skull Rock Treasure Hunting Company. That's pretty neat. For $5, I kind of like that a lot. For $5, you can have some Mickey ears from somewhere beyond. This is amazing. This is from International Festival of the Arts, right? No, this is from Food and Wine from 2016, where you can do the Ratatouille hide and squeak, where you had to find all the Ratatouilles, all the Remy's from around World Showcase, doing some pin trading. And they're bringing out like tons upon tons of pins. I feel like she's, she's pretty excited for it. Wow, I'm wondering where they're going. Look at them all, they got more here. I don't know how you find out about this, but this is just like lots and lots of pins that everybody lined up to do pin trading in. 
and they've got these over here too. So these are the first people that were in line to pin trade and it was like a big celebration. And I guess they have pins from every park and from special events. Because we didn't even know this was happening. This is pretty neat. Ooh. This is so neat. Look how much they have to choose from. It's like a little bit of everything. So the next one that will be available will be Monday, May 22nd. We do it once a month. I like how this Pinocchio hat has an official conscience, 18 karat. Is that in the movie? Yeah, he's he's the conscience. Oh, this thing, I don't yeah, know. I don't remember that. I think it might be a pin that he gets from the fairy. Oh, okay. What is that? Is that Mohawk Mickey? It looks very what angry. Is. What is that? I think it is a mohawk. I think it is a mohawk, Mickey. It is three ninety nine. If you're wondering, <laughs> Pinocchio was also three ninety nine. Mm. Are you gonna put it on? I don't think so. I don't know. You're gonna be Johnny Depp. <laughs> this could be good for like a Halloween costume if you wanted to be Johnny Depp for Halloween. Or just like a... from Through the oh, Looking Glass. Who's the guy from um, the Mad Hatter? Remember the tea party at Disneyland? Oh yeah. The main guy. I think that this. Doesn't he wear this? Yeah, because. So you the... can be him. You can be like the guy from the Mad Tea Party at Disneyland. Yeah. How much is it? Oh. Uh, only $4.99. That's a steal. <laughs> I think this is one of the coconut guys from Moana. Oh, I think it's it a, is too. It's a Tsum Tsum. And these Tsum Tsums are buy two, get one free. So you get like a Star Wars one. You could get, I don't know, a Yoda? No, just kidding. That's a sand person. I think he's one of the Lost Boys. Is he? Yeah. He looks really angry. <laughs> yeah. uh, I think he is from, he's Vision. Oh, I didn't know that they told you what all the things were. So, no, you got, you found out my secret. I was gonna <laughs> say that that's, <laughs> that's Vision. This one's Hawkeye. Oh, yeah, you can see they have all, do they have all three of the hitchhiking ghosts or just? I can't, I'm sorry, I'm maybe holding just this. Like two. Let me show you this. So okay, you sorry. Away. I found this, uh, Cheshire Cat, he talks to you, but it's very loud, so hold on. Yeah. Are you all mad here? That sounded frightening. What did he say? Uh, he said, <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to be he it, sounds like a said, minion. He said, I can't do something something if you're going to be like that. But he but he goes, if you're going to be like that. Oh Stop it. How do I make him? Okay. Ooh, right, he's we're possessed. Done. We're done with him. I don't know if they have all of the hitchhiking ghosts, but they do have Madame Leota. Oh. Look how adorable this is. It's That's... 20 bucks. It's half off. It was 40. Now it's 20. Oh, it's like a full baby set. Yeah, you get like a little onesie outfit, a little plush, a, a little hat. And a little bib. Oh. And it's so cute. How much was that Cheshire cat? Oh. Ten bucks. Oh yeah. That's that's like nothing for something that mumbles at you. <laughs> you could buy a tiny goofy outfit for ten dollars. Ah. These appear to have been very popular, some Epcot themed plates for five dollars. Do you remember this? Yeah. It's on clearance now. Surprise, surprise. For how much? It's Oh, it's not on clearance. Oh no. It's just regular price, but it's here. Oh no. Huh. Yeah, I'm with that kid. It looks like these plates from Epcot are very popular. It's five dollar plates that are all Epcot themed. So you got Journey into Imagination, Spaceship Earth. Uh, I think that's it. I think that's all that we got. There's a Jungle Cruise one over here though. How much is the Jungle Cruise one? It's $3.99. Oh, a little bit cheaper than the Epcot ones. Somebody told me though that when you put these in the dishwasher that the decal peels off. Oh no. So I don't know how true that is. That was just something that somebody told me. Some Skyway salt and pepper shakers. This is so fun. Oh my gosh, look at this one. It's a tea a party. Tea party set. And even the push the trash can. No, I think that's just an Adventureland trash can. Oh, Tomorrowland. Or Tomorrowland, yeah. Gotcha, okay. So Ooh. how much is everything? Uh, Tomorrowland trash can is $2.99. This one is $9.99. And $9.99. This, wow. this one is actually really, really cool. I feel like really this cool. is the best deal. Yeah, I like this a lot. Ah, there's another stack of Journey into Imagination plates over here, so they're not all out. This looks like a, a Fantasyland tea towel. Of course, we know that this is Disneyland's uh, Fantasyland because of Casey Jr. there at the bottom. And this is $9.99. They do still have a lot of Christmas stuff. I like this Chewy Wear Home shirt because when I first saw it, I saw it from the side and Han Solo looks amazing. You know what? What? And this is $13. Oh yeah. I never thought these would go to the outlet. They're only 12 bucks. Nice. And this is Join the Celebration on the Forest Moon of Endor. And it's like hitchhiking ghosts. 
but it's all of the Jedi's that have passed. But I knew that this was like a big cellar, so it's weird that it's here. Yeah, there's another rain jacket here for $25. Looks like you can get, oops, looks like you can get a couple of different ones. Here's a Disneyland one. Yeah. Um, can I ask you why there are Expedition Everest drumsticks? Why not? I thought it was for Rock and Roller Coaster, but... No, Expedition Everest. The Yeti's in like a really sweet rock band, apparently. Yeah, what's it called? It's called... Um... Yeti Harold and the Prayer and Flags. The... Is his name Harold? I think that's over in Disneyland, isn't it? Yeah, what's ours his name? I don't think it has a name. Is he just the Disco Yeti? Disco Yeti. So would he be like the Disco Yeti and the... Super Freaks? And like the Hustlers? <laughs> or I don't know. Got a, a discount shirt from Planes for $10. I heard they're coming out with another Planes movie. It's kind of cool. Yeah. I actually really like this vintage Iron Man one for $15. I know, all the kids stuff is really cool and it's only yeah. in little kid sizes. What the heck? I kind of like this Progress City shirt, but it's a hoodie. I don't really like the fact that it has a hood on it. And it is $13. There is a huge, huge section of Star Wars action figures here. Are they all discounted? I think so, for $15. They're half off. They were 30 now they're 15 Nice. Check this out. It's like a Lego person that you build from Star Wars. I can't find the price. 19 bucks. It's not in focus. For $19, you can build this Star Wars person. The Disney outlet certainly has a lot of Disney Cruise Line stuff from I would, 2016. I would definitely say if you're going on one of these cruises, maybe don't buy the merchandise on the boat because it's yeah. always here. Always. I think this mug is all of the different concepts that were Buzz Lightyear before Buzz Lightyear was Buzz Lightyear. That's pretty neat. It's only $2. This is like his... Uh, his concept art? Yeah, I think so. Oh, that's interesting. There's a couple of Run Disney items from the marathon that was just in January. Right there, you can say you ran the marathon. It looks like it's still full price though. Ding dang, for $30, this one. And just getting ready. This one doesn't have a date on it, so you could wear this next Halloween, or this Halloween. Oh, yeah, nobody will know. Nice. Let's see, how much is it? $9.99. Well, that's not bad. Yeah. I like this. All of the Run Disney oh, like decals magnets. Yeah. for you to put on your car and say that you ran a half marathon. So I wonder if you shouldn't get your stuff at the expo because it's cheaper here. Right, but you never know that it, it might yeah. not be there. All the good stuff is probably gone. Yeah, Santa Yoda is still here. Nice. Eight dollars. I thought these were kind of cool. They're like little tiny Mickey ears, earrings. So it says like Mickey Mouse and then it has like the little Mickeys. Six ninety nine. I have to admit, Mother Gothel from Tangled kind of looks like uh, Gaston. Oh, this pirate that we found before was not one of the Lost Boys. He's just a pirate from Pirates of the Caribbean. Did you find my the perfect picture for me? I did. I was like, oh my goodness, you know who would love this? Tim, because he loves Olaf. He's one of Buzz. Kids will blow dandelion <laughs> fuzz. fuzz. Got a whole box full of parade cushions for two dollars. We decided to get some postcards. We didn't have like a big, huge purchase this time, but we got a Space Mountain postcard, a Jungle Cruise postcard, and the Cool Haunted Mansion postcard. Card. I like them. And they're all $1.95. A little Death Star rolling luggage for $20. Now an M&M's vending machine I've seen plenty of times, but I have never ever seen a Pringles vending machine. $2 for some Pringles. We are on our way back home and check out this shot of Volcano Bay just like right over the interstate here. Wow. Man. I can't wait. It's gonna be so awesome. Check out all of that inside of there. I wonder what all of that is. All right, so we are driving back home, as you can probably tell from that shot from the highway. We, uh, our plan today was to go to the other outlet, which there are two Disney character uh, warehouses. There's one that is on Vineland, and there's one that's on iDrive, and they're both premium outlets, and they're fairly close to each other, but because it's rush hour right now, we totally, I mean, it was gonna take us like almost 40 minutes to get, I think it was only 11 miles away. Yeah, it was very close. Yeah, I think there were like a couple accidents and it's also rush hour traffic. And so because we like poorly planned the timing of this, we're gonna head back home because we're kind of cutting it close on the timing, but be on the lookout for another video from the other character warehouse sometime soon. Cause we definitely want to get back out there and see what that location has, if they have anything different. So this is the other outlet that we were talking about. It's right there. I wish we could just drive right there, but to actually drive there on the actual roads would have taken us a lot longer. So we'll see you next time, other outlet. For dinner, we got public subs and this is one of my chicken tender subs, or it's my only chicken tender sub, but 
sometimes Publix does a really good job of making it. Other times, it's kind of a mess. This is one of those messy times. But it was still better than making our own dinner. Ooh, yeah, boy. Guys, thank you so much. We reached 200,000 subscribers. You guys are the best. You guys. We did it. Thank you guys so much. I can't believe this is awesome. Yeah. It like just happened. Brady, our friend Brady, he is the one that tweeted it out. So thank you so much to Brady yeah. for uh, telling us that it happened. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, this is awesome. And thank you to everybody who was like retweeting and sharing our channel and everything. You guys are awesome. And we couldn't have done this without you. We wouldn't be where we are without you. Yes. So thank you so much. This is amazing. I'm like in shock kind of. Yeah, thank you guys yeah. so much. Yeah. But uh, we will be going to another Disney outlet soon. Yeah. And yeah. all the stuff that we saw today was amazing. Yeah, there was some fun, some strange stuff there, but some yeah. fun stuff. A lot of fun stuff, a lot of strange stuff. Yeah. But now it's gotten way late, and we will see you guys tomorrow. And now it's time to pay the price. Yeah.